yeah, I'm absolutely thrilled with Daenerys. He's such a good boy, and we have such a great partnership. And he always gives me everything in the ring. So, and today he definitely didn't disappoint. I mean, our hardest struggle have been the flying changes. I think mechanically for him, they're really difficult because he's built a little bit um, bum high. And they are getting better. They're much better at home. They don't always come off in the ring yet. Um, but I think in another year, uh, hopefully we'll get those solidified and then we should hopefully be on to a really great score. But otherwise, I couldn't have asked for any more from him. But you're still probably not going to be a huge amount off the pace by the time dressage is done. And that's built solely on the trot work and the canter work without <laughs> the changes, which is just amazing. Well, we've worked really, really hard to claw as many eights as we can everywhere else. You know, I worked very hard through the winter to make sure all the halts were square. And, you know, I've just tried to train every other little piece and I've had great help from a variety of trainers who've just given me little extra things you know little pieces where you can hopefully drag another mark out and um, like I say he is a wonderful horse and he always goes in and brings his A game so it's it's a joy to be sitting on something that you know is going to be there for you. Going around the cross country course here where did you sort of stop and scratch your head and turn to your right hand man and go what do you think? <clears throat> Oh, probably everywhere, to be honest. It's my it's my first burley, and um, I'm trying really hard to just respect every fence. You know, I think I think the questions start right away from fence four. I mean, I think that's a bit more challenging than they've had in the arena for a while. Um, I think it demands a bit of respect. I mean, the whole course wants respect the whole way around, but certainly the middle of the track is the meatiest and intense. Um, so I'll be walking it two more times today and probably again tomorrow, but I do think I have a, a burly horse. Um, he's a big jumping, galloping, bold horse, and um, I always believed he'd be good here, so hopefully uh, we'll, we'll give it everything we have anyway.